Hi guys, hi family, hi family. Welcome back to my channel. If you don't know, I am C2 Random. So today I'm gonna be sharing some things about some Pisces that you might need to know if you're dating or you're married or you're thinking about getting married or whatever the case may be, you need to watch this video. Pisces love to daydream and they are very emotional water signs. They are very, very emotional creatures. So anything emotional and romantic is kind of their forte. They love people who are who are sensitive to their emotions as well. And Pisces are psychic. They kind of have this like psychic, mystical thing about them where they know what's up. So don't try to fool them because they can see and they can read between the lines. They're very sensitive to anything like the slightest of the slightest thing. And it can be kind of aggravating. <laughs> If you know you do something and you really don't mean it that way and they kind of nag you with that expect, don't get nagged by that. Don't look at that as necessarily a bad thing, but you do need to have a strategy to kind of counterpart that way. They have a, a real way to make you, I know with women, they have a real way of making a man feel like a man and a man has a real great way of making a woman feel like a woman. They have that robust sensitivity to their mate and making them feel really powerful and really good about themselves. Pisces are mutable. And what that means is that they have the ability to change their character. And you know, if they really, really love you, and they're really into you and they're, there's something about what you do that is not agreeable to their zodiac makeup, they're gonna change that. They're gonna figure out a way to kind of mimic what it is that you want. They can be, the great thing about Pisces is that they can be whatever you want them to be when they're really in love. So if they're not really great cooks and you just need someone that knows how to throw down in the kitchen they're gonna do what they gotta do to take a cooking class and to figure out how to do that thing they're gonna watch cooking videos and watch the cooking channel and figure out how they can communicate with you in the way that you so appreciate i think pisces is probably along with cancer is probably one of the emotional most emotional out signs in the zodiac like bro they are emotional so love really brings out the best in them and if they're really in love they're feeling really good they're at the top of their game however this can also be really bad when they're in love and they kind of just want to cut everything else out like love is all they need and, and love is all that there is they can kind of become codependent and that can be really, really bad when you're in a relationship because you still have to be an individual and you still have to, everything can't always be love and romance all the time, 24 seven. And sometimes when they're not feeling that from you all the time, 24 seven, they get really just emotional about it. They, they're really unhappy about it because they expect you to give to them love and shower them with affection all the time but you can't be that way all the time so just be sensitive to that and know that you know like if you're just not a sensitive person mm, Pisces might not be for you but you know if you do kind of understand that and you do care a little bit more about their sensitive nature then just look out for that just kind of you know be prepared for that that's why a lot of Pisces go really really well with other water signs like cancer and scorpio because those people can understand their emotions on a different level because they're also too very emotional pisces are very spiritual very mystical people so anything dealing with that you know tarot astrology uh cult topics of that nature are is a plus they're also very good sympathizers they're very good people they're great people to be around when you know you're having a really hard time and you really need somebody to talk to 
and you just, you know, and because, you know, Pisces love to talk on the phone. They like to talk, honey. They are the talkers of the Zodiac. So they're naturally just really down for, you know, talking or anything that's going to, it's soothing to them. So they're going to be down for that. They're going to be down for a really good talking, conversational talk. And Pisces are also very impressed by people can, who can make them laugh. They love being around people like that. Pisces are very artistic, so they love and appreciate art and creative things of that nature, you know, like art shows or museums or anything that's really like artsy, dance, music, that kind of stuff. And the Pisces are very sentimental. They appreciate sentiments like doing things for their birthday and anniversary so really really important to like make sure you don't forget about those things when you're dating and you're married and you know you're you're romancing they love that bougie gougie wishy wishy kind of stuff and always compliment them make sure you compliment them and make them feel great make them feel like the man or the woman that they would they want to make you feel because this it goes a little goes a long way so just remember that so with all that being said guys i hope that you enjoy this video this is the end of the dating a zodiac sign series i hope that you guys really really enjoy all of the videos please go check them out if you haven't watched all of them also if none of this stuff resonates with you at all or if you're just not understanding where i'm coming from then you really need to check out your natal chart i will leave a link below where you guys can go check that out and put your birthday in there Put your the time that you were born that's really really important the location of where you were born at though all of those aspects really do play a role in the type of person you are and what you like and what you don't like and who you can approach and all of that good stuff so with all that being said i will see you guys on the next video please be sure to thumbs up and subscribe and i will see y'all later peace